Hey, welcome to my new listing at 422 Preble Street in South Portland. Um, if you look around here, there's trees and birds and just a wonderful sense of space. Um, believe it or not, we are right in the heart of Willard Square, which is just phenomenal. So let me take you around um, and we're going to uh, go to the front of the property and uh, walk up the, uh, the main walkway so you can see what I'm talking about. So here we are in front of 422 Preble Street and that's the door we're going to head in. But I do want to show you how close we are to uh, Willard Square. One of the things that um, I think you might love is you are like, you could just go to Scratch Bakery every morning or even help them make their bagels if you want. So, um, so I'm going to uh, close this gate and then I'm going to show you how to get your car to the um, to park where you want to park for that. Hey, Sorry. Right around the bend here from Scratch Bakery, uh, you'll see the stop sign. Now we're going to walk down this driveway, and this is where this is the neighbor's driveway here, and you have an easement to get to your drive to to park to the house. So this driveway is always kept clear. They've got a friendly dog. And this is the nice, this yard does not, this belongs to the neighbor. And this is your yard back here. Uh, we'll take a look at the shed at the end of the video. And why don't we head inside and come take a look. So one of the things that you'll notice about this house first thing is all the exposed wood on the ceilings. It's just wonderful. You got your hardwood floors, the uh, wood stove. And right now there's tenants who are living in here. They're going to be moving out this summer. So we'll be ready for you um, when you come in. Um, you got a nice uh, dining area here and then the kitchen. And just a small step down, you have your mudroom if you were to come in from the back entry area. And your laundry is down there as well. We can check out the basement later on in the video. I do want to take you up to the second floor first. Before we go upstairs, there's the bathroom in here. I want you to take a look at that. And as we come up to the top of the stairs, we do have a full, uh, full bedroom here. Obviously, it fits a double-sized bed. And then the next bedroom is right on the other side, so you can come right in here. And there is a closet in here, so this is a nice size closet. Uh, nice size bedroom and they're using it as a closet. It could be a closet actually or a home office uh, if someone wanted to work from home. So this is a great, oh my gosh, this is a great year-round place, summer place. Let's look at the basement and then we'll head outside and look at the um, outdoor. Here we are in the basement. Um, not super tall ceilings. It is an older home um, and uh, fine for storage. You'll see the person does have, who lives here does have some things up on pallets. And um, let's go outside and look at the outbuilding. What's nice about this outbuilding is you have plenty of room for storage for wood. Um, these guys primarily heat with wood. And uh, you do have this interior space here. It is finished. It is not heated. Um, so someone could do a space heater in here if they would want. Uh, and come summertime though, which technically we're in, um, would be a great yoga space, meditation room, 
art studio, so lots of options. Uh, we are um, going to be coming on the market this week, and uh, please contact your realtor if you'd like to see it. And uh, if you're not working with a realtor, give me a call. My number is 207-232-6127. I appreciate you watching the video. Thank you.